Welcome back to the channel. Matt, what are we doing today? What is the plan? Catching fish. <laughs> Ca catching perch and pike. Lots of them. Perch and pike, lots of them. Strap in. It's going to be a cold one. So here we go. We got 38 degree water temperature. And that's a cluster of fish down there. Some fish on some grass, I think. Matt just says it's all fish. But regardless, Matt's out there. He's already casting. They're moving. There's his lure. They're coming up. Got him? Yeah. He's got him. Good one. Let's see him. Not bad. Oh, yeah. Bad. Bring him right over here. Show him to the people. Take a look. A jumbo perch. We'll <laughs> get better ones than that today. But that's not a bad one. Cool. They all taste the same. Is that? They all taste the same. <laughs> Not sure what Matt is using, but this is what I'm gonna throw. It's a funny jig head, gumball jig head, and a rhythm wave. What do you think? Is that gonna work? I think if it swims, it'll catch. If it swims, you wins. Yeah, you should be right on him where you are. Yeah. Got him. Nice man. On the scoreboard. There's a pike. Where'd that pike go? There's, they were all over. Huh? There's hey, one right on, there. Where is he? Which way is that? Okay. Hold on. I got it. Somewhere out there. Where'd you land? There's two probably, of them there. Probably right there. Come on. Oh, there's one right under the boat. You see him? Excellent. Definitely. On the net? Uh, yeah, probably. Wouldn't hurt, right? <laughs> That's definitely cheating. Yes, sir. Watch the peak. Where he bites you off. Okay. Got it pretty deep. Oh, that's a snot rocket, man. Yeah, just a little one. Your problem. I'll get his bigger friends beside you. Just a little one, but still fun. Yep. I was actually surprised at the ones we were getting the other day. Surprised by what? How big they were. Yeah. Just a small guy, but still fun. Spotted him on the live scope. There was two of them out there. I have one ripping after me right now, see him? Oh yeah, Matt's got to chase it right now. I should grab the screen, show you. Just got him on the Z, man. I'm gonna send oh, I missed him. Just twitch it, give it pauses and stuff. That's some things kind of waving it under the boat. Oh, you bugger. You felt him? Yeah, it's definitely a fish. Yeah, he needs to have a wider cone, eh? Got him. There was a lot of them out there. Big one. Wonder which one he got. Nice, dude. It's a smaller bite today, eh? They want the finesse. Yeah, oh, he's not big. He's not that big. Nice, bro. Hey! hey. I'm not going finesse. He's big and large. Can't get this thing to sit right. Oh yeah, I'm the greatest fisherman in the world. Literally like six. Another not big one at all, but definite fun. I caught that on my perch rod. He's got my bait in his mouth. I want it back. That's what I caught it on. Just a little rhythm wave swim bait. Decent pike. Send her home. Got perch all over us. Run? Yeah. Oh yeah. Spot lock off him a bit. Cast at him. Looks like pike and perch mixed in the same school. Of course. Funky looking. 
Where there's perch, there's pike, man. This is basic math. <laughs> you would think they would be smart enough not to live right with each other, but... <laughs> Holy, that is a city of perch there, man. Wow. I'm probably on. They're staying on the bottom, eh? Yeah. I am on. I had one. I got grass. Okay, there's a slew of perch in front of the boat. They're pretty far, no? They are now. There's close ones, too. Ooh. My lure's right in them. They just won't bite. That looks pikey. Ah, oh, there's like five or six of them there. Gotcha. Gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha. Perch, man! Woo! Double up. There's fishes in the hood, man. They're all big, eh? That's what I like. There's yeah, they're no all good ones. Queen fish. They're all good ones. That one's got some weird. Oh, big pike just ruined the party. Of course he did. Ooh, big one. They're under the boat and just staying now, buddy. Oh, not a big one. Not a big one. Not even a bad day keeper. And there is a difference. <laughs> That's a fish. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> it's caught in the grass. Oh yeah, there's a perch. Yumby. Nice. So would that be a small one for you on Simcoe? No, it's a good one. Anywhere you go. So I'm to the camera, not me. I did. Well, the camera can see, Jesus okay? Christ, man. Just give me a sec. I'll catch another one. Oh, there it goes. This feels good. Looks good. Oh, hey, not bad, not bad. There's the whole fish. There's one. Woo! I'm getting downsized, fella. Gave that one a little head trauma, that's okay. fish around they're just moving like crazy <laughs> my leg is too asleep to do anything right in front of the boat there's a school One anywhere you go. I bet you 13. Yeah. Woo, that's my thumbnail right there. I feel like that's a baby in that perch tournament that they have. That's yeah, not. It's still not the right sign. No. So I'm not sure if you guys have been following along, but we've been like chasing the perch around constantly. The second we get on top of them, the troll motor starts whipping up because it's so windy out here. The perch are like spooking off. Making it really tough for us to stay on the perch. We get on for a second, we grab a couple, and then they're gone. Then we got, then we yeah, had Mike too chasing them. And then we end up finding them again with a live scope, panning around, locating them, get on top of them. We've been trying to keep the boat away, like off of them and casting to them, but even at that point, they're still kind of very skittish and they're just kind of avoiding us like the plague. So they want to hang out 80 feet from the boat, and we can't cast 80 feet against the 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we might go venture into like a nearby marina and see if we can get some shelter in there and see if there's maybe some warmer water and some fish hanging out in the boat slips. Might be the play. We'll see. We just pulled into this marina and I immediately feel like there's nothing in here. Water temperature is actually colder in here than it was in the lake because there's ice still in here. So, here's what it is. I'll show you the ice. Nice. Yeah, Matt says if there's any in here, they're going to be under the ice. So it's, right there. Okay. But in my experience, like you come into these spots because you want warm water. We'll see, we'll give it, a, give it a shot anyway. Well, we gave up chasing around those perch, fished in the marina for like a few seconds, it was way too cold in there, there was no life with the live scope, we knew that right away, didn't see a single fish, so we dipped out of there. We're gonna call it a day. So yeah, fishing always sucks in our videos because we're fishing in these dirty, dirty weather days. It's like- It's like minus one or two right now, <laughs> 50 kilometer winds, it's awful. Yeah, it's starting it to, starting so to snow. Yeah, it was literally starting to snow. But not bad, honestly, shouldn't be so, uh, it was a good day. It for, was a good day. It was yeah, a good day. We got, good some, day. got some big perch, yeah. got a couple pike, at least I did anyways. Yeah, <laughs> I, was, I was lacking today. Today was not my day. But if you want to book a guided trip, you can give either one of us a call. Uh, we'll be doing perch trips until the end of April or basically until lake trout season, right? Yeah, doing trout right now too. Oh, yeah, lake so trout Matt's going got trout on. available up north, right? What you, yeah, one hour yeah. north. One hour north, you can do lake trout trips with Matt. It's not my cup of tea. I don't like to go so far. I like to stay close to home. So I'll be doing perch trips until May 11th and then lake trout trips and whitefish and pike open up again. So if you're watching this video before April 1st, give Matt a call. He'll take you out for a pike trip. It's really a lot of fun right there, right now, snow, sniping them on the live scope. Should be really good right now. Should be really the good. They're, good they're freaking everywhere. We literally saw so many today. They're just in a funky mood with this cold weather. This time of year, they don't really like this dirty weather, I guess. They like the warm sun. It's supposed to be a beautiful weekend. So if you're watching this, it's before April 1st, give Matt a call, he'll get you out. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing just perch and crappy trips. Give us a shout, outdoorjunkiesguideservice.com. CA. OutdoorJunkiesGuideService.ca and FishSimco.com Thanks for watching. Drop the anchor on the subscribe button and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.